Now, CBS 47 Eyewitness News begins with breaking news. Right now, there's a hazmat situation at Central and Golden Rod in Fresno County, just south of Kerman. We're told more than 70 people have been exposed to a pesticide. Thanks for being with us today. I'm Joey Horta. CBS 47's Pedro Quintana is there live now with late breaking details. Pedro, what's going on? Joey, good afternoon. We're told 75 people working at a nearby field when they were exposed to this chemical. Currently right now, those workers are being rinsed off with soap and water at this facility nearby right here, where currently the hazmat has been set up right now. Now, joining me right now is Fresno City Fire Captain Oscar Bettencourt from the hazmat team. Oscar, can you just talk to us in regards to how many people are complaining of symptoms? Well, as, as you mentioned, we had a total of 75 individuals that were exposed to the uh, chemical. However, 24 of those those were actually showing or experiencing signs and symptoms. Out of those 24, we ended up transporting three of those. And in regards to three of them were transported, what were the symptoms that we're complaining about? The major symptoms were vomiting, nausea, the skin irritation, and also tingling in the mouth and the tongue area. Do we know in regards to what the chemical was? Um, we identified the chemical, however, because it's under investigation, we're not going to release those chemicals just yet. Um, obviously, for us, it's important that we identify the chemical before we can actually treat uh, our patients. Do we know in regards to how they were exposed to this chemical? All we know is that they were in an orchard and there was a, a tractor with a sprayer. We don't know exactly the details as to what happened. We're going to let our investigators deal with that. Okay. Captain, thank you so much for the time. Thank You're you. Welcome. Thank you. And Joey back here alive with that. We have much more coming up tonight on CBS Eyewitness News at 5. For now, we're live here in Fresno County. Pedro Quintana, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.